for the last six months, we've just been kind of touring and playing shows, um, a lot of shows. Uh, we released a record called There Is Only You last November, and we were on tour for like three months straight when that came out. Went to Europe, UK twice, um, and then, yeah, we're currently on a headline tour just now, um, and then, yeah, that's it. Just shows, just a lot of that. that. <laughs> A lot of it. Mine's is a bit higher. I don't do either of those things. Yeah, yeah, yeah things. your hands. Show them, yeah. show them oh, what you do. Yeah, 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 like yeah, yeah. Pretty much like that. I don't care no more. I don't care no more. Uh, the reception of the album has been amazing. It's been nothing short of incredible. Just, yeah, everyone we meet at shows, it's been so positive and it seems to mean a lot to a lot of people. So it's really, yeah, we're just finding that out at every show. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, it's quite a uh, personal record. Um, I think all our records are, but this one in particular was uh, a lot of hard work went into it. Uh, a lot, of, a lot of personal trauma, a real journey. Sorry. Yeah, it's alright. And uh, yeah, it means an awful lot to us in the fact that it's relating um, to a lot of people that are coming to our shows and uh, uh, us kind of widening our audience. Um, yeah, it's it's been, yeah, a great trip. It's been great. Uh, agreed. <laughs> if there's been any bad reviews, we haven't been showing them. So yeah, yeah. everyone's <laughs> covering our eyes uh, yeah. or sticking the pages together. Yeah, yeah, totally. No, no, don't turn that page. It's been it's great. Yeah, it just goes on to say how great it is. Don't worry. <laughs> Plans after this tour are pretty much the same. We kind of it moves into festival season and doing some festivals. Gonna be outdoor for a little bit of the summer. Yeah, mm -hmm. outdoor. We'll probably crack on with the next batch of songs and um, yeah, keep active in that way. Maybe go into the studio and start demoing. Yeah. Um, but I mean, yeah, it's really more of more of the stuff we were just talking about that whole. And that you yeah, up here and that you're yeah, yeah, showing yeah. again. Yeah. Uh, yeah, more <laughs> of, more of that stuff. That's all we seem to do. That's I feel like we've work. been doing that for the last like nine years or something. I think that's what like being in a band is. Right, right. I'm surprised we're not like stuck. It's weird, isn't it? It's cool though. Sometimes I'll be waiting for a coffee. I'll be in a queue waiting for a coffee, and I'll just be like, "Oh, totally." Just in it. I'm like <laughs> in HMV, just looking at CDs. And I'm like, check, <laughs> check one, two. Oh wait, I'm not. All right. <laughs> We were here last year, and I like have found myself watching more bands than I do when I'm outside, mm -hmm. which is really weird, and I can't really explain it. Um, but yeah, it's it's a cool festival, though. We, yeah, like I said, we were here last year, and we had a blast. Um, so we were chuffed they asked us back, um, and it means we get to see Oathbreaker. We're, the, that band are so cool. Yeah, man. Yeah, we saw them yesterday. Skin Dread too, man. Skin Dread. I hope they play some deep cuts tonight. It was yeah, all it was great estate shit last night. Yeah, so <laughs> I wanted that. I want my deep yeah, cuts. Some the album tracks, tracks, man. I want track eight and nine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I want track eight and nine. Sick. Secret Which track album? as well. No, no. just any album. Play that? Track eight and nine. Um, Doesn't their matter, second really. one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they've um, it's got the best beat. Sick times. Yeah. Hopes and dreams. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> That's my way of phrasing the question. Into yeah, I mean, I think we all dream of like some sort of normality in our minds, mm. but that's done because we've been in this band since we were, well, me and him since we were like fifteen, and we this lineup's been together for eight eight years. So the dream of normality is dead, yeah. dashed. That is the, the, <laughs> the one hope though that I have is all aspects of my like my life kind of synchronizing and actually being able to work together rather than just constantly. Fighting with each other, you know, <laughs> tour life and home life, and <laughs> having money and stuff. I guess that would be all right as well. I don't know. <laughs> as far as the band, that was very deep. Yeah. yeah. Uh, as far as the band go, yeah. I mean, yeah, we want to be playing bigger shows and um, be allowed to keep releasing records and you know, to just fucking like be the size of Bruce Springsteen in the E Street Band. That'd be a nice way to live. Even just the E Street Band. Just the E Street that. Band, yeah. 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 Okay, just yeah. One of them. They have a pretty decent career even without Bruce. Like, yeah. 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 They probably still do shows. It'd be nice to like sell out Brixton. That's that's a dream. A boy can dream.